pets, bitches, and losers, and all you fabulous fucking women out there that are fierce and taking back our fucking power. Um, I always get a snarky fucking remark. And the funny thing is, most of the time it's from chicks about when I do videos and I don't have makeup and shit on. But here's the thing, bitches. I like to give my face a break. When you get older, trust me, putting all that shit on your face all the time. And I love wearing makeup. I mean, I love makeup. I actually have a makeup issue. I need a fucking sub just for supporting me in my fucking beauty regimes. Oh, that would be a dream sub. Oh, so hello, any subs out there that, you know, we're talking about hundreds of dollars a month. If not every probably six months, probably one month. Yeah, probably every six months, it'd be probably close to a grand. Yep. I can see these subs being like, bitch, what do you do? Um, but anywho, yeah, I don't give two fucks. That's the beauty about feeling good about who you are. You just don't care. If, um, like, I get it. It's always like, well, you know, you want to be attractive so you can, like, uh, attract subs and blah, 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 blah. I don't care. If, if they're going to be like, oh, she's a fucking ugly bitch without her makeup on, then, all right, I'm an ugly bitch, but I'll still dominate your motherfucking ass. So, anyhow. Anyways, enough about that. Yes, I'm not wearing makeup. I have some errands. I wasn't even going to do a video today, but I got some fucking errands I have to do. And I was like, I'm super fucking proud of myself because I got, I slept in. So on my days off, I do try to sleep in. And I mean, sleeping in for me is like 8 a.m., 8, 830 if I'm lucky, 9. But, and then I like laying in bed and snuggling with my little baby dogs and have my coffee. And usually when I have my coffee and everything, I get on my computer, check emails, pay bills, do whatever the fuck I do, and get on Twitter and check my messages and so on and so forth. And sometimes I can just go into the fucking black hole that we all know to be Twitter. So today I didn't do that. Today I did not do that. I was like, bitch, get out of bed, get your ass going. You got shit you got to do. So... Yeah, I was um, proud of myself. What is this guy yelling at? Okay. Damn. Ah. Um, so anyways, uh, yeah, so I got some shit I got to do. I got some errands I got to run. And anytime I do, anytime I do errands, if there's any like thrift storing in the vicinity, I go do that. I am completely fucking addicted to thrifting. I love it. I, I don't know if I've meant, I think I've mentioned this. I used to have my own business in Los Angeles where I bought and sold vintage clothing. And a lot of it was like, it was from like the 1920s up to maybe early sixties, but I basically specialized more or so in 40s and 50s. Um, I used to sell to like collectors, um, movie people. Uh, I would sell at flea markets and stuff like that. So it is a rush when I can find something that is worth something. I still do sell stuff every now and then on my eBay. Um, but also because of what are you doing are you not paying attention do you want to go what are you doing okay thank you um but since at my vanilla job i have to wear all black and for those of you that don't know what i do i'm a barber slash stylist um i do men's hair mostly shaves and all that other stuff um so, and i work for a company that's you know, they want us to look sharp, but fuck, I, you, uh, your, your clothing just gets embedded with hair and it's just a pain in the ass. So I honestly, probably about 90% of what I wear at work, um, I get thrifting. And I've gotten some really nice designer pieces and stuff like that. People are always like, oh, I love that. But anyway, so I'm a little obsessed with thrifting. 
I love to thrift. Bitch, watch yourself. Um, so yeah, I got to run some errands. I'll hit some thrift stores. I gotta go to the grocery store. So I'm spending money. So you know what that means. If you want to impress me, bitches, impress me. <laughs> but anywho, uh, what else do I want to talk about? Oh, I gotta clean the house too. <laughs> Uh, I wish uh, I just wish there were more days in the week if that made sense um, I just feel like uh, there's just not enough time to do everything no. um, I want to say hello to all my new followers on Twitter if you're watching this I appreciate all of y'all most of you are finding me through my videos and I really appreciate the words that you send me and thanks. I, um, I am not going to lie. It always feels good when people praise you, especially other strong women who, you know, I, I don't know. It, it's just great. I really appreciate it. And I appreciate the subs too. Yeah. Um, but I don't do that, do this for that. I don't do this for validation. Honestly, I probably do it more as like a diary vlog for me to just like, bleh, you know, get everything out and vent because honestly, the only people you can really vent to about this life are people in the life. So it's not like I have a couple vanilla friends that know what I'm doing, but it's even hard to talk to them because usually we're around other people and I can't be like blah 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 so we gotta like talk and code and shit it's a pain in the ass but anywho um so yeah I think I do this a lot for um some exposure I mean I've gotten some subs off of this I definitely have gotten some subs uh from this so that's cool um but yeah just kind of I think for my mental capabilities and I do want to help girls. I was, um, uh, talking on the phone last night with my amazing dear friend. I am the red headed queen. Um, and we were talking about how, uh, how, um, I know a lot of people don't like me doing these videos because they're like, you shouldn't be telling these girls. Yeah, we don't need more girls. I'd just rather you guys do it right or try to do it right. Do I know everything? No. Um, yeah, I've had some crazy DMs from girls. Um, somebody was like, uh, I think I talked about it yesterday. Yeah, I talked about it yesterday. But um, motherfucker, I got cut off. But anyways, I will splice this shit together. Um, I've had girls ask if I would mentor them and that they would pay me. And I'm like, no, um, I don't want you giving me anything. Um, and honestly, I'm not shaming, please. Bitches, don't come at me. Don't come at me. There are, there are doms out there that do mentor other doms for a fee and I get that because honestly they but it's a full-time thing for them I mean they will really I mean if you do pay a dom to mentor you or something like that um uh that's fine that's fine just make sure you're getting your money's worth I just I don't have the time to do a one-on-one -on -one mentor with anyone or multiple mentors um please dm me questions and when I have the time, I will always answer. Sometimes I answer right away. Sometimes it might be a couple hours, a day or whatever. It's not that I am ignoring you or anything. It's just, I got vanilla life and shit like that. So that's why I don't want to mentor. And also, um, yeah, I mean, if this was like a full time thing for me, uh, because I, uh, had a couple switch subs, females, um, in LA that I kind of mentored, um, you know, like techniques with floggers and blah, all that stuff. Um, but I, I just, yeah, I, I have no problems answering questions for you guys. I appreciate that you even offer money. And I have to say some of you ladies are just so 
sweet on how you come into my DMs being like, I hope I'm not wasting your time. Oh, baby girls. Love you. You are so much. Look, subs, look. These fucking chicks fucking, <laughs> fucking have more respect than your little fucking pinky toe. Mm. But I, I, it's just, I really appreciate the sweet words and comments. And you know what? If you ever want to do something sweet for me, uh, July's my birthday. July 6th is my birthday. I will be making a big fucking deal out of it. And, uh, you could, you know, drop me a couple little bucks, tribute to me a couple little bucks for my birthday or, or buy me something off my wish list or something like that. But you don't even have to do that. You could just say happy birthday queen. You know, I, I really am not in this to try to exploit other, um, women who are trying to find their path in this world. Um, I had somebody be like, why are you putting your referral? I mean, you're just trying to make money. Here's the deal. Um, I don't follow anybody. I've said this over and over and over and over. Who do I not follow? I do not follow catfishes. I do not follow subs. And I do not follow other women who don't have adult website verification because I have no fucking desire to follow somebody who looks like they're 12 and I don't want to contribute. I'm sorry. I don't want to fucking contribute to that, this fucking lifestyle until you're of age. And trust me, I know people can log on to here and be younger and so on and so forth. But like I said, I am going to start a diary and I'm really going to get fucking raw and real with you bitches about how I got into the sex working industry. And a lot of it is fucking not all rainbows and fucking butterflies. So I'm just saying like, you know, I, I just won't. So the whole point of me putting my referral, if I go and see you follow me and then you DM me and I only, only give my referral out on my, on my Twitter. And if somebody DMs me, I, I never, if I see somebody who's like DM, uh, who's followed me and they don't have adult website verification, I'm not going to send them fucking my referral link unless they hit me up first. I'm not trying to do that shit. Um, but yeah, I will. I'll be like, Hey, you know, uh, if you want to use my referral, if you want to go with AVN stars, if not, you know, find one you like, I don't care. Um, yeah. If somebody uses it, do I get a referral fee? Yeah. You get 5% of their earnings for life and it doesn't come out of their pocket. It comes out of, uh, whatchamacallit, it comes out of AVN. So that's cool. But, um, you know, it doesn't matter. You know, if you want to, don't. I'm not doing this for the fucking money. I'm not trying to, you know. Trust me, I see some bitches out there that try to fucking finagle people, other women. But anyways, I just want to say thank you so much for your kind words. And uh, I appreciate y'all. I really do. I, I like, I'm all getting kind of all warm and fuzzy. But anywho, I am at my first stop. I am going to go inside and do some shit. And I will post this probably later on. Yes. But anyways, ladies. And for the rest of you fucking subs, you know what you're supposed to do. Tribute. <laughs>